both number nine and answer choice B, we've got the same problem. You know, if you want the healthy bones, you've got to have the right amount of calcium. But that doesn't mean that having calcium will be enough to guarantee that you have healthy bones, right? There's all these other kids with calcium that don't have healthy bones. In the same way in answer choice B, if you want the cake to taste good, tea for tasting good, then it's got to have the right amount of flour. But notice that having the right amount of flour doesn't guarantee anything. And then in 9, we're saying that if you didn't have healthy bones, you didn't have calcium. But that's not necessarily true. You know, you got all these other kids here who might have non-healthy bones and yet did have calcium. You got all these other cakes here that didn't taste good and yet did have the right amount of flour. The problem is in both instances, we've been given a necessary condition and then acted like it was sufficient. But, I mean... What that boils down to is just this.